What up boys and welcome back to another video. It's currently where I live in Norway 1 a.m. But I just had to get this video out there right now as the news just came. And we're going to talk about the WoW token, the future of it, the uh, Blizzard gear store and all of that. Before we dive into the information, I do want to mention that this video is sponsored by myself and the 0 to 10 million gold guide. So if you guys are struggling to make gold or want to take it to the next level, this is a book that I've developed for over a year now. And it has a step-by-step -step setup that will teach you how to go from 0 gold to 10 million gold. Not only that, but every uh, expansion that comes to retail, I'm going to keep on updating the book so you guys will always have relevant information. And obviously, if you've already bought the book, you will receive every single future update for free sent to your mail. So don't forget to use the code SHADOWLANDS on checkout and you will get it for 50% off. And you'll find the link to it down below in the description and the pinned comments. So what are we actually talking about today with the gear score? So the gear store. Uh, Blizzard has uh, came out with some news, right? There's going to be a brand new Blizzard gear store experience coming soon because Blizzard is currently using a third party to sell their merch and that's what speculated that Blizzard is now going to sell it on their own platform and they're saying that the Blizzard gear store will be closed for like a short window starting already January the 1st. And an interesting thing about this is that they will cancel all like the, the gift cards and everything that is currently valid right now won't be valid after the change that they're doing. So it's being speculated that they are in fact bringing the gear store over to their own platform. So what does that mean for us? Well, it means that potentially blizzard could allow us to use a battle net balance in order to purchase physical goods imagine you're farming in a video game and you're able to buy the sylvanas statue for actual gold or like just cool sweaters and t-shirts and whatnot it's a very interesting topic that is being was brought up first that i could see at least from vadis on reddit going through like the pros and the cons and it's like an open discussion forum where people can discuss if they think that this is actually going to happen or not. Because by all means, this is not a confirmation video that you will be able to buy physical goods using uh, like virtual gold battle net balance. It's just a speculation that the Blizzard would actually allow us to do this. So what do I think about the whole thing? It could be a good move from Blizzard. Because imagine if they give us the option to buy uh, physical goods for battle net balance People like myself would spend multiple gold caps buying the WoW token, getting battle balance, and just buying one of each item on the gear score. So that would naturally mean that the WoW token would be extremely pricey, at least double in value, probably. And that would lead to the people buying WoW tokens to get gold, like the people on the opposite side from me. They would get way more gold for spending their 20 bucks for a WoW token. So that would lead to way more people that would normally get their gold by spending real dollars to spend even more right now. Because, hey, you're getting a shit ton of gold out of it, right? So it would lead to inflation. Sure, man. But Blizzard would make a lot of money. Uh, I for sure hope that that is the case. I don't care if I have to spend 800,000 gold for a WoW token. It doesn't really bother me. But as of right now, it is strictly just uh, speculations, though. And Blister did say that they will come back with more information shared soon, uh, hopefully before January the 1st, so we know what's going on. And one thing that I do know, that, uh, like, I use WoW tokens regardless for, like, upcoming expansions, game time and whatnot. So I'm going to make sure that I am capped on Battle.net Balance and also have 10 WoW tokens ready to go in my bags uh, just in case that happens because it doesn't really matter i use the wow tokens anyway so might as well just buy them now in fear that they will double in value so let me guys know what you think about this whole thing down below in the comments section do you actually think that blizzard will allow us to use virtual gold to buy physical goods or uh will they just change it like put the battle net store over to uh, or the merch store over to a drone platform maybe even open up like a location for europe 
right? Like, who knows? It's very interesting uh, regardless. And god damn, I hope that you can be able to use Battlenet Balance for physical goods. That will be big. That will be absolutely massive. Imagine what it would do to the gold making community. How many people would actually get into gold making because they want to gold make so they can buy a t shirt and don't have to spend real money on it? They would just farm gold for it. I think the, uh, I think it's going to have very interesting uh, side effects if they actually end up putting uh, the gear store up for uh, purchase using Battle.net Balance. Super interesting topic. Let me know what you think down below. I'm also going to link the Reddit thread down below in the description. That's it for today's video though. So thank you all so much for watching. Subscribe if you're interested in more videos like this. And you can always press the thumbs up button if you found the video interesting as it really helps out me and my channel. And of course, if it's of interest, check out the 0 to 10 million gold guide link down below. But thanks for now and I will see you all back in on tomorrow's video. But until then, bye bye.